the joys of winters here on Vancouver Island is we don't get a lot of snow and when we do it doesn't stay around very long. We did get a dump of snow last night. It got up to about four inches where we live. But you can see in the background it's already turned to rain. It's starting to, to um, disappear which is fantastic. But the downside of our snow environment is that majority of the time the snow is really really wet and heavy and that causes a lot of problems. I was cooking breakfast, I already heard a bunch of cracking, snapping, and a tree coming down, and it has taken, Kevin, don't bite me, um, it's taken out our fence. So, uh, it's in our Cooney Cooney pen. I see you, Kevin. Uh, so we're supposed to actually be going into town uh, for a doctor's appointment, but now we're having to deal with the down fence and keeping the pigs in. So, yay! Great day. Zagar is going to have to come out here with a chainsaw and cut this. We're going to try and put the fence temporarily up. Thank goodness these guys are short. Um, keep them in until we can get to town and uh, get some more fencing and fix this because it's actually tore. You can see it's actually ripped the fencing all together and this is I think 16 gauge I believe we bought. And the thing that kind of irritates us quite a bit, as you can see this is the tree that broke, is it wasn't even leaning in the direction of the fence. We took all of those trees down. Just this one decided to explode on this side of the tree. Oh, there goes another tree I hear cracking in the background. I'm not sure if you guys heard that somewhere over, over in that direction. But anyways. <clears throat> Um, it exploded on this side of the trunk, which then caused it to come down and flatten my fence. So yay. Yeah, so uh, that's now on the road and we'll have that to clean up before we can leave because it's the only road out of town. Fantastic. <laughs>